Welcome to this week's edition of Chats News. I'm Sian. I'm Cedric. Here's the news for Wednesday the 6th of May. Students in Year 5 have been utilizing Google Docs to collaborate in real time with each other in group-based activities. Year 5 students have been working hard on their wonder projects. We have Eugene and Liz who are going to share. What did you do for your wonder projects? We made a slot eat and a story jumper book. And we made slides and a, a book in story jumper. Also, uh, also a cow quiz that we both worked together to make, but Liz didn't know how to make a cow food quiz, so I made it for her and put some of the cow, put some of the quizzes that we put in our slide. Thank you for, thank you for your time. This is Joshin and Oliana reporting for Chats News. At Chats News, we continue to connect with the people that make up our Chatsworth community in an interview series we're calling Chit Chat. Today, we chit chat with Miss Pinto. Thank you very much for joining us for a chit chat. Hi there! When did you first arrive at Chatsworth? I've been working at Chatsworth for the last 11 years. This is my 11th year. I joined in 2008, August. How long have you been working in education? I've been an early childhood teacher for the last 16 years. I love working with the little ones. Why did you decide to become a teacher? And what are some of the roles you've had throughout your career? I decided to become a teacher because I really enjoy working with small people. And I have also done the musical. I've been part of the musical production at Chatsworth for the last few years. I have a little background in music. I love it. What do you enjoy most about working at Chatsworth? I love Chatsworth because it's been home to me and Ilana, my little girl, who's not little anymore, she's a big girl now, but it's been home to us for many, many years and we really enjoy coming to school every day and meeting all our friends. What would you like to say to the Chatsworth community? The only thing I can tell you is while learning takes place in school, it can also take place at home and your teachers miss you very, very much. We can't wait to get back to school and pick up from where we've left off. Thank you very much for your time. Take, keep safe and take care everybody. Yesterday, secondary students have participated in the Geography Challenge. Amongst the questions were who used to work in a ski resort and who hiked in the Himalayas. Congratulations to the winners. Keep a lookout for more live activities happening after school at 4 p.m. Would you like to win a $40 book voucher? Well, there's five of these prizes to be won in the Chats to a Stay Home Activity Contest. Simply, snap a photo or a video of something you or your family have been doing during the circuit breaker period. Write a short summary and email it to this address for a chance to win. We'll be back with more Chats News in just a moment. Hi, this is my present, my slideshow. Sports presented and made by me, Gus. What is sport? Sport is physical movement that helps you get strong and healthy, although it is very hard to master it. Why is school good for us? Let's say you're in HBL and your mother and dad say you need to get outside twice a day, but there's a really good reason for that. There's lots of good reasons for that and I'm going to tell you one, because stretching helps you get more flexible and flexible is good. Well, AFL. AFL is made out of 18 teams. My favourite is my enemy is Collingwood, so you can look, that's my favourite player and he's in my team. Football. Football is a little bit like AFL, but the differences are position, just rules, and more. Try playing it.
Where can you find live sport? Well, it's quite easy. You can find it on TV and stadiums in certain places. Bye bye. See you next time. Now it's time for the weather. Ian, how is it out there? Um, the weather is, it's, it's pretty good. The weather's uh, pretty good. Um, thanks, Ian. And that's Chats News for Wednesday, the 6th of May, 2020. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you online. Stay safe. Bye.